lady again I'm back with video number two to discuss the list that I talked about um, last time the list that I I guess I can make it a to be read uh, TBR as they call it list of books um, just to elaborate on that list it is a list that I want that I found on essence that I said in the last um, video I found on essence and it was kind of dated all these books are pretty old but like I said I just never read them before and so I wanted to go back and read some things that had a bit of literary value something that I don't know to give me something to think about not just for total entertainment even though I love fiction fiction is my favorite but I wanted to get some things with some substance in them so um, looking at my list here I'll go through my list and name a few that's on this list some names that stick out to me um, the very first one on the list I've already read a few of them I've already read and rather enjoyed um, some of them I've just never read before but um, one that comes to mind what looks like crazy on an ordinary day by Pearl Cleach I've seen a lot of great reviews about that um, Native Son by Richard Wright Sister Outsider Essays and Speeches by Audrey Lord, Lord I guess excuse me Women on Busa's Place how many times have I seen that movie and never thought to pick up the book and of course as we know the book is always better than the movie so I'm going to start reading those I finished this book here I finished Kendrick by Octavia Butler I picked it up on Monday today is Thursday I finished it this morning it was such a great reading I guess maybe one of the videos I'm planning is maybe do a review on some of them and since that's the first one um, I'll probably do a review on that one um, the next one on here the back of the berry by Wallace Thurman things fall apart we all know that one came by Jean Toomer their Eyes Were Watching God by Zora Neale Hurston, one of my favorite books. So I definitely will be reading that one again. A friend bought it for me as a birthday gift. So I'll definitely open up that book again since I have it on my shelf. Fences by August Wilson and uh, Why I Love Black Women by Michael Eric Dyson is actually on this list. This is on the list I made. This is the list I found on Essence from Essence.com. So we'll see what happens with um, these books. I'm very excited about reading them. Getting back to read again. Um, I used to read, like I said, all the time, but I haven't been on it like I usually in the past. So I'm looking forward to that. I'm also looking forward to I'm going to plan another video I'm gonna do a book tag so it'll be a little bit more about me and what I like to read and things like that I'm also gonna do a bookshelf tour now my bookshelf is got old books on there so but I feel like I should do a tour of those bookshelves because it'll give you an idea of what my normal reading is even though I've become a library fanatic I go to the library I don't hardly buy books so hopefully I'll get those other two videos done or three videos that I have in mind and get those done and get those out um, and then continue reading I'm gonna start on the next book I'll wait to return this one to the library until when I've done the review on it and um, I'm gonna start on the next book probably when I get off work today and again I hope you're having a good day this will end my second video. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.